Alright folks, welcome back to the channel. My name is Tyler. If you are new, welcome. Today is going to be an unofficial two-week documentation process for me. Um, uh, I've started seeing YouTube videos and stuff online about cold, uh, showers and stuff. So, uh, about two weeks ago now, about 14 days, and I haven't been specifically keeping track just because I haven't felt like it up until now. Um, I shower once per day, especially during the summer when it gets hot and humid and muggy outside, and I do it before I go to bed. What I do is I'll take about a five minute regular warm, lukewarm shower, and then um, I'm up to. I don't keep a timer in the bathroom with me, but I'm up to about a minute of me counting off 1 1,000, 2 1,000, 3 1,000, that kind of sort of thing. The first night that I tried it, I think I managed 10, maybe 15. But the shock to the system that I got was pleasant. And it felt like it helped me sleep a little bit, sleep a little bit easier. And I was reading up some more on it, and apparently there are other benefits to it. Not everything is proven proven, but Let's see if it'll pull up for me. All right, so pain and inflammation, cold water immersion can temporarily reduce pain and inflammation. It can also help reduce chronic joint pain and muscle soreness. Uh, excuse me, I am reading verbatim here a little bit, so excuse me. Uh, muscle recovery. After exercise by lowering core body temperature and tissue te tissue temperature, which can help reduce thermal stress and fag. Improved circulation. Boosted mood. Improved immune system. Healthier skin and hair. Increased willpower, according to a human health psychologist, Dr. Kelly. Organical. So it's done good. Undergoing uncomfortable activities like taking a cold shower can help build up power and resilience. La, 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 la. And apparently, the main disadvantage of them is that many people consider them uncomfortable. Now, I will admit, the first few nights that I was doing it, I don't think I got above 20 25 seconds the first three four nights, it wasn't pleasant and, and I'm not eventually I think it possibly might be pleasant but as of right now I am right at a minute worth of doing it after I finish my regular warm shower and it's I'm not gonna say I love it but I don't hate it but yeah man or worst case you have an uncomfortable shower but I definitely say give it a try it can help. But in any case, like I said, this is about two weeks worth of me doing it. I'm up to about a minute's worth of it after the shower. And this is mainly just for me to have a document, that documentation on, on the internet for, for myself personally. If it helps you or someone else that you may know or share it or whatever, be my guest. <sighs> in any case, y'all, hope you have a fantastic day. Leave a comment down below if you do a cold shower or, or, or if that's not in your wheelhouse. Um... In any case, uh, appreciate the views, appreciate the subs, y'all stay tuned.